So the challenge that uh, I'm undertaking with a couple of colleagues is the Yukon Arctic Ultra. It's a trek across the Yukon, it's 300 miles. It has to be completed in eight days and temperatures get as low as minus 50. So it is gonna be a real hardship out there. I'm doing it because a friend of mine, one of the guys that I'm on the trek with, Phil Wall, is a founder of Hope HIV. I'm a patron of that charity and, uh, and he asked me if I'd like to do something a little bit testing this year, which I did because I'm a retired rugby player now, I need a challenge. So there are three of us that make up team Telly City. Uh, it's myself, Phil Wall, and uh, Alan Chambers, who is a polar explorer. The training that we've been doing today, we've, uh, we've had some sledges out, we've got harnesses and everything that we have to tow across the Yukon, so we've been trying to replicate that. We've, uh, we've been up and down Box Hill, getting some uh, miles in the legs together as a, as a three, and uh, getting used to what we're gonna have to be encountering in the Yukon, although it's not quite as cold here in, uh, in London as it will be over there. The snow has been ideal and to be honest, getting around has been a bit of a nightmare. So we've been quite lucky having the, having the Land Rover with us because we already had to dig a couple of other cars out of the snow just trying to get up the hill. And to be honest, if we didn't have uh, the Land Rover with this weather at the minute, we would have struggled to even get it. It's fantastic to be um, doing something like this with someone you've been inspired uh, through in sport. Uh, that's and you followed as a sportsman. So that's just a real privilege and there's lots and lots of fun. But also to be working with someone who uh, has been willing and often has pushed himself right to the limit. That's going to be a great kind of model to follow. So I'm looking forward to that. This is going to be one of the toughest there is in the world. And I, and I think for us as a team, I think it's harder to complete start and finish as a team. So I think that's part of the challenge, not just the terrain, the temperature, but actually finishing it as we started as a, as a threesome as such. We, we don't have to take any rifles, so I'm not too worried about the grizzlies or the polar bears or, or the wolves or anything like that. More than anything, probably the frostbite. I have, I have pretty bad circulation in my, in my fingers due to years playing sport, so that's what I'll be concerned about more than anything. I'll be trying to keep my hands warm.